Work is now underway to fix a black mold problem in Vanita Public Schools. The $5.6 million bond issue passed a few months ago. New at 6, 2 News reporter Liz Bryant tracks the progress. Last week was the final bell for the school year here at Vanita Public Schools, but it's also the last one you'll ever hear in this building. Maintenance crews are unscrewing the doorknobs here at Hall Hostel Elementary. Anything we can take out and get our hands on because the whole thing's going to be torn down. But the hardware won't be thrown away. Everything's being stripped down that we can use because of our educational budget these days. Black mold got the district into this position, tearing down the school and rebuilding a new one. All these ceiling tiles and everything will just be taken off with the building because we're not going to take any chances with our new facility. It would leak and the rain would come down. Just down the hall is Becky Campbell's room. I have mixed emotions about this room. We had a lot of good memories. Today is the first day she's seen what's left of it. We still had the Mimeo boards up, the smart boards. We still had cabinets along the walls. And Becky's not only a teacher but also a parent. She's seen how black mold affects her children. She was to the point they were going to take her tonsils and adenoids out and the child had never been sick. But once she was out of this environment, she was fine. Before crews finish a brand new hall hostel, Becky's stuck out here. They don't look like much now, but they'll be nice classrooms for our kids to temporarily be in for the school year for next year. These portable units will hold 400 students. Then they'll be finishing the walls, redoing the ceilings, replacing some of the insulation that's in the top. Demolition here at Hall Hostel starts July 7th and the rebuild begins one month later with a brand new school opening one year later. Reporting in Vanita, Liz Bryant, 2 News works for you.